Welcome back to Tea to Green. It is an absolute joy for me today to be with two of my favorite people, Taylor McCorkle and Alexis Thomas. Ladies, I gotta tell you, what are the chances that two of you being good friends, player of the year on the Wisconsin PGA Junior Tour, co-player of the year in high school golf? Absolutely amazing stuff. So to all the young ladies at home that are watching this that really wanna go on to play some junior golf in their future, Alexis, behind the scenes, what are some of the things you're doing? Well, it definitely takes a lot of dedication and hard work. Um, something that I've always done over the years is spent my time on the range, hitting knockdowns, hitting any kind of shot, and then also short game. That is definitely the major key to being successful in golf. Taylor, we'll hop right over to you. So you had a really <laughs> big summer, right? You won a pretty big tournament. What was that? Uh, the Wisconsin Junior PGA. And so what were your rounds like? Did you expect at that time of your career you were going to win this thing? I didn't. I mean, the first day I shot 75, and I knew that I was like in contention to um, maybe win. And I mean, that first tee, that first hole was not good. <laughs> I <laughs> I had a double bogey on the first hole, and so after that, I was like, you know, you just had to settle into your round. And so I just stopped thinking about like winning, and I stopped thinking about what I have to shoot to be able to like possibly win and I just played my own game and ended up shooting 68. Well so. we were all sitting in my office all the employees and we we're like refresh 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 and then the powerhouse Lauren Skiba comes in with a really low score and we were kind of thinking man oh, yeah. it's her tournament again yeah. and I'm texting your dad and your sister and she's not playing very good I don't know what's going on out there and then all of a sudden what was your final round score? 68. 68 unbelievable come from behind and because you win that tournament the Wisconsin PGA Junior Championship what happens from there? I actually qualified to play in the National Junior Championship which was in Rhode Island. And? So um, I didn't make the cut but I shot 75 76 and it was a really good learning experience. I was happy like I was a little upset that I didn't make the cut I wanted to but um, I was just happy that I got to learn and I got to feed off of other players games and yeah how they play. for years I thought maybe if I could get this tournament a big national tournament at Blackhawk Country Club that we could showcase some of the talent of the Wisconsin girls and lo and behold the qualifier happens and then we see in the brackets just like March Madness Alexis and Taylor could meet if you guys both pl both play good tell me what it was like when you saw that you were gonna have to play each other starting with you Taylor um, I didn't know that I was going to play her after I won that first uh, match and then when I found out, I mean, it was like, I kind of was a little upset about it because, <laughs> I mean, we're such good friends that I didn't really want to have to play against her. Yep. But, um, I mean, we, I think we probably both just wanted to go out and play our game and just have fun with it and like you said, just showcase the talent yeah. in the Madison area. How about yourself? Um, same with Taylor. I was a little nervous at first because, you know, like, Taylor's a great player, <laughs> but like, um, but it was also fun to play with like my future teammate and we definitely both in both situations want to push each other to get better. I think you've taken girls golf to a whole new level and we are really excited to watch your future. So I can't thank you guys enough, Taylor. Thank, thank you for you. joining us, Alexis. Thank, thank you, you for joining us today on Tea to Green and we'll be right back. <laughs> 